Good morning, y'all. I'm back at it this morning. Came back to the beach. Happy Monday morning to each and every one of you. Thank you guys for joining Yaya's Best Life and this 31-day journey. So I'm going to get my exercise in this morning by doing a little bit of walking here on the beach. I wanted to switch it up from last week from the treadmill just to kind of try to work some different muscles. It's a little harder out here. As you can see, sand is really thick, so it makes you work a little harder, but... Okay, y'all, got that 20, 25 minutes in on the beach. That sand is rough on me. There's a lot of sand out at this beach that we've been going to. You got to dig your heels in and come up out of it. But uh, it's totally different than, you know, when you're just on the treadmill. So that's why I wanted to come on out here and push myself for me, uh, one more day uh, at working through the sand. So, uh, anyway, and it was nice out. It was a little warmer out today than it was yesterday. But I got it in, so uh, I'll see you guys in my breakfast clip. Hey, y'all. Okay, I'm fixing my breakfast, as you saw in the previous clip. Went out to the beach this morning, uh, got me some walk-in. And as I told you in that previous clip, that sand is a mess. But I did, was able to get my heart rate up and uh, get some walking in this morning. So I feel good about that. Now I want to share with you uh, what I am going to fix myself for breakfast in the next clip. So I had found this recipe. It's basically, there's two eggs. And I have some uh, ginger, garlic, red pepper, spinach, and onions that I chopped up. And uh, I'm going to show you how I'm going to cook this. And uh, this is what my breakfast will be today. A healthy breakfast. Okay. Let's get this food going because it is 1049 Eastern Standard Time and Yaya is extremely hungry and we talked about this before. I'm trying to wait to around 9 or 10 o'clock before I uh, eat. So I'm trying to, I'm implementing several different things and I'm trying to see what's going to work best for me. So the intermittent fasting um, along with uh, my calorie reduction, meaning healthy eating, plant-based eating, raw uh, vegan eating in my meals, along with um, exercise. So um, I'm going to heat up. You saw I put a little bit of uh, olive oil in the skillet. And uh, I'm going to saute these veggies here, my onions and my um, red pepper, garlic and, um, sorry about that, garlic and um, what I have? Ginger. So I'm going to let this heat up. I'm going to saute that stuff. Then I'm gonna put my egg in. Here we go. Y'all like the sizzle? I like the sizzle. Put my egg in and then I put my spinach in. I'm gonna cut me up an avocado on the side and I got a bit of watermelon and some strawberries that I'm gonna have with my breakfast. So, we gonna put all that together, y'all. I love some ginger. I love the smell of it when it's cooking and the garlic. All of this stuff smells so, so good. So, yeah, day six, y'all. 
I'm still having a good time at this. I'm glad that I am staying focused on my choices of food intake. Um, it's different than what I've done before. I'm just cooking only at home. I'm not eating anything outside of the home. And I'm trying to stick to vegetables and some fruit. There, y'all can see that. Get that tossed a little bit there. So I use olive oil. Let my onions get translucent here. Let my ginger and garlic soften up as well as the red pepper. And this has such an amazing aroma. And when you use all of your stuff like your garlic and your ginger and you use it from the root then you don't have to worry about doing all of that seasoning. I'll probably use a little bit of pepper. Well, pepper's not bad. I'll use pepper. And then what I use a, just a bit of or a pinch of, it's a little bit of salt. In my eggs, I did put pepper, some slap your mama, and uh, I think I did a pinch of salt. So... And I like my little stuff here to be crunchy. Okay. Let me prop y'all back up here so you can see. Can you see in the camera, Tim? Yeah. The egg and stuff? Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Eric. Put my eggs in here. Okay. Oh, I want to remind you guys the uh, Hypothon is this Saturday, March the 11th. And I got to get my thumbnail up so you guys, as a reminder. Also, um, Tim and I will be on at from. 12 to 1 uh, p.m. So we're going to do some cooking. That's what we're going to do this time. Do a little brunch for y'all. So make sure all of your notifications are on. If you're watching this video and you're new here to Yaya's Best Life channel. Oops, I forgot. Y'all saw I messed up. I meant to put my spinach in. But I'll drop it in now. Doesn't it look good? I like my eggs to be soft, so I'm turning the burner off. Now, normally I would have. I got to talking. And, uh, you leaving? No. Oh, okay. Um, normally I would have put my spinach in when it was the eggs were still a little bit more liquid, but... Yeah, y'all got to run in her mouth and forgot to drop the spinach in. But I think it'll be okay. Look at that. So this is our breakfast. Let me plate this. And then I will show you guys the plate. Hang tight. Okay, in this clip, this is Yaya's day six breakfast. I showed you in the previous clip how I cooked my uh, veggies and um, with two eggs and I have some watermelon and I had a little half of uh, less than half of a banana left and so I'll be trying to work with the foods because I don't want them to go bad so okay 
I said, let me come back because this tastes so good. I had to show y'all. Back for the next clip, you guys. It is about 4 o'clock here, Eastern Standard Time, in Southern Florida. And uh, as you see in my previous clips, just for a recap, went to the beach again this morning. Did me a walk in that heavy-duty sand. Um, but that was okay. It got Yaya's heart rate going. Um, I showed you in a previous clip also what I had for breakfast, which was really, really good. Now this is my lunch and my dinner. So I made me a raw salad. I got all kind of stuff in here. Lettuce, uh, spinach, uh, chickpeas or gobanzo beans as they're known, broccoli, cauliflower. I have some tomato slices on the side. I have some ginger root chopped up in here, some garlic chopped up in here. Um, some avocado here on the side. I sprinkled it with turmeric and then I sprinkled it with pepper to activate the turmeric. Um, I have white onions in here. I have some purple onions in here. Let's see, is there anything else that I put in this salad? And I am very, 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 very hungry. So uh, this is going to be absolutely delicious. So I wanted to share this with you. I hope y'all like it. And I put Italian uh, dressing on the salad. Oh, and I have cucumbers. That's what else is here. Cucumbers. So this is going to be absolutely delicious. Oops. So I said, let me come back and share a little bit of this goodness with you guys. There's nothing better than a good old salad. If you like, you know, ginger and garlic, which are very have very good health benefits. I'm going to start sharing with you guys as I continue my own research on things. The benefits of all of these good foods. What it does for our body and what it gives us. like cucumber and the broccoli and the spinach, and avocado, garlic and ginger. I use a lot of the garlic and the ginger in a lot of the um, fat burning teas that I've been making. So I'm kind of putting something all together and I'll be sharing with that with you guys real soon here. Mm. Y'all can tell I'm hungry. I wasn't really eating a lot of meat these last few months, but I've not had any meat, nothing at all whatsoever these last six days. And that's what I wanted to accomplish. I mean, I got many more days to go till I get to the 31st of March. But I'm on day six. I haven't had any meat. I haven't really craved any meat. But I tell you one thing that really helps me a lot is drinking my warm lemon water in the morning. And I'm really enjoying and glad I found this recipe for the cloves and um, cinnamon. And I make a tea out of that. 
and I drink that first thing in the morning and I drink it kind of throughout the day and uh, and then I'll drink my lemon water as well and I don't know it does something for me that's for me yeah yeah my taste buds and it's like I haven't really been craving a lot of carbs or anything like that so I think that first day I had the avocado toast for breakfast and I had that multi-grain bread but um, that's the only bread that I've had and the rest of the stuff that I've had has been you know oatmeal or either um, vegetables be it raw or yesterday I cooked that cabbage steamed it so I'm not going to keep y'all. I just wanted to come back on, put a little short clip in here to let you guys see more of the salad. And I'll see you guys tomorrow on day seven. Have a wonderful, wonderful uh, Monday. Bye, y'all. Deuces.